Hi guys and welcome back to another rewards video. This week obviously we've got Div Rivals and Foot Champs Raw. Div Rivals I think we're Div 4. Um, we'll be floating around rank 2, rank 3, I have no idea. So let's just grab them quickly and chuck them in. Whilst I'm grabbing these make sure you like and subscribe um, to the video. And let me know what you've got down below. It'd be great to hear from you guys to see what you've got. Um, Make sure to like the video though, because that's what kind of helps the channel grow the most. And I really appreciate the growth we've been going for at the moment. We've gained like 50 subs in such a short period of time. So it's been amazing. The support you provide is great. So that's that's great. Um, we got rank two. So that's not too bad. I didn't really, I didn't play at all. So this just off the weekend league. Two jumbo prim gold packs, two mega packs and two rare player packs. Obviously all untradeable. I want as much fodder as possible, to be honest. Um, and foot champs. I've just realised I forgot that I'm stacking a load of packs, so I'm hoping that I can still access these through the store. I was going to have to unlock, uh, open some of the two-player upgrade packs, but that could kind of be a kind of mix of this video. Um, we got gold one, yeah, gold one, 50k, two jumbo rare player packs, and two player picks. The player picks are the important part, so let's jump straight into them. Raul Albiol, 85 rated. We'll take it for the rating, nothing else. Um, and then we get... Oh, well, oh shit, Lecomte and Pizzi. I'll take Lecomte for rating. Could have taken Pizzi as well. But both horrendous cards. Um, we might be able to do a gold up. The upgrade pack, I'll have to have a look after this. If we can, I'll whack one of them in here as well. And we'll aim for the 86 upgrade. All the packs are here from the looks of things. So that's great. Let's go straight in with the Jumbo Premium Gold packs. These are obviously the bad ones. We're not going to get anything good in them, so don't I don't expect anything. Um, nothing from that one. We're not going to sit and watch for all the doors and everything, because I don't see the point if we're not getting anything from it. Um, just wasting everyone's time. I don't really like wasting you guys' time. Um, but yeah, make sure you let me know down below what you've got in your rewards. I'd like to I'd like to hear from you to see what you've got. Um, do you think it's worth the 30 game grind? I've had I've done quite a few weekends of just playing to 14, playing probably about 20 games um, to get to 14, maybe a bit less than 20. But getting to 14 games and then stopping. And I have to say, it was some of the most enjoyable weekends because the stress is gone, isn't it? Okay, that's a rare player. But no board so far. This isn't good. Rewards have been awful so far. So let's hope for let's hope this this turns around. Um, I did ask for fodder, and they are providing. For the sake of this video, I'll quick sell Thomas Party. I don't like quick selling, but I don't want you guys to sit there while I have to go off and do another upgrade pack and recycle everything. It's not fair for a short video. Um, oh, that's a board. It's just a board though. Um, French centre mid. Taliso, yeah, Taliso. Um, is it worth the grind of thirty games for the rewards we get? It seems to be quite a big discussion online at the moment. Um, a lot of people saying it's not, and it's hard to disagree with them. It's it's hard to disagree that it's not worth the grind. We're gonna go mega packs and we'll end on the jumbo rare player packs. Um, it's getting to the point where it's quite tedious to actually play the weekend league more than anything. Not even boards. Wow, these are awful. Worst rewards I've had in a while, for certain. Usually get a couple of boards and things like that, but this has just been absolutely horrendous. So, shocking. Genuinely shocking. A lot of fodder going into two, <laughs> two rare gold upgrade packs and stuff like It's a joke. Um... Yeah, so it is. If you are you still enjoying playing with boards, just boards again. Yeah, are you actually enjoying the weekend league, or are you playing because you feel like you have to? Because I see a lot of people playing because they have, they feel like they have to to get the rewards in order to improve their team. Which I suppose that's me in a way. Um, I usually enjoy, say, a third of the games, ten out of thirty, which is a ridiculously low amount. Um, we'll just take the Sabios. Yeah, it's a ridiculously low amount to enjoy. But then I enjoy the menus of FIFA, so I'm probably a weirdo in that sense. Um, 
honesty, I enjoy the FIFA menus. I enjoy going around, trading, doing different bits on them to see what I can get. Right, we're down to the last two packs now. This has been absolutely shocking. We're down to the last two packs. So we've got a Jumbo Rare Players Pack. Let's open this up. Oh, boards. Just boards, though. Absolutely awful, awful reward so far. Yep, Pepe 84 rated. Great for fodder, I suppose. I think it's going to be tradable, actually. But still good for fodder. Um, and just a bunch of duplicates. That was awful. Let's just hope there's something in the Jumbo Rare Players Pack. Because I can't be dealing with there not being. They're boards again. Oh, wow. Just boards. Is that Manzukic? Yeah, Manzukic. They're the worst. That's just... I think that's reiterated the point, or that's answered the question I asked earlier in the video about is it actually worth it? So no. That is absolutely shocking. Um, I earn more from the bronze pack method than I do doing the weekend league. In probably the same amount of time I have to put into the weekend league, I earn more in the bronze pack method. Um, if you don't know how to do Bronze Pack Method, I will pop a link down below in the description for you, so you can see that. Um, and also pop a little pop-out link here. But that's just shocking. That was absolutely horrendous. Um, then we want to have a look if we can do an upgrade. I've not got any red cards that I care about. Premium upgrade. I don't know how many I've got. Is it just two left to get? Oh, it's three. I don't I think they're already in there. Uh, Leconte. Raul Albiel. These footmas cards are too similar. I keep thinking I got one. Oh, wait, Stewani. Yep, we're going for the upgrade. Feels kind of weird getting rid of some of these players. Like. I could use 88 immobile for a one second premium. Yeah. Um, I could use immobile for an upgrade pack or for a SBC, but I don't really feel like that's a good idea. Um, so what we'll do is we'll just get that submitted. And we're going for the 86 upgrade. Here we go. I'm not looking forward to this as much as the next guy. One of three, 86 plus. Give us something good. Why do we bother? I'll take Wijnaldum because of the Premier League and Liverpool link. But that's just shit. Absolutely shocking. Oh, God. Well, that's rewards for the day. Um, absolutely horrendous. Quite disappointing, really. Um, I've got some ideas for some videos coming out. I'm going to look to do um, showing how to apply the bronze pack method onto the league SBCs. Um, how to basically get the league SBCs. But not necessarily free. You would be able to get them free if you grind it properly. Um, league SBCs for near enough free along with um, what the actual reward back would be. So, is the Chinese Super League profitable? And I'll do it for every league. I'll complete all the league SBCs. Um, and then we've got, um, as you can see, I'm, I'm grinding up some packs through the bronze pack method. I wanted to grind up to 50 um, gold upgrade packs via the bronze pack method. And then I wanted to open them on, on video or on stream with you guys so you can see what it, it kind of is but um if that's something you're interested in do let me know down below and if you've got any ideas for videos that i could do let me know down below i always appreciate kind of any feedback or any ideas that you guys share but once again absolutely awful packs um not not impressed with the packs today they're they're just the worst really bad packs as you can see 
transfer list is stacked with bronze cards because it earns me more than my bloody weekend league, which is shocking. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching, really appreciate it, and make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you at the next video. Thank you for your time, bye.